Hello and welcome to the 3M A test vaporized hydrogen peroxide trimetric chemical indicator 1348 and 1348E scientific literature review series. The purpose of this series is to, to provide a brief review of the studies that have been conducted since the introduction of the trimetric CI. The first CI for hydrogen peroxide and surgical pack monitoring to demonstrate that it independently measures three critical variables of the sterilization process. Just like many clinicians do now when monitoring their packs in steam sterilization, so that they can provide a higher level of quality assurance for patients. Several studies have been conducted since Trimetric's introduction, with topics including color stability before and after exposure, detecting process failures in a clinical setting, and an evaluation of hydrogen peroxide CIs in a laboratory setting. In today's session, we will focus on the study that examines before use color stability of a number of hydrogen peroxide CIs that are currently available. And at this time, I'd like to introduce today's speaker. This session will be led by Larry Tilapa, 3M's application engineer for the Trimetric CI. Larry, take it away. Thank you, Sean. Hello, hello, everyone. My name is Larry Talapa. Thank you for watching our 3M A-Test Vaporized Hydrogen Peroxide Trimetric Chemical Indicator 1348-1348E Scientific Literature Review Series. 3M study on color stability before use with vaporized hydrogen peroxide CIs is only a few pages long and includes three charts that contain the images of each chemical indicator tested and the color change observed in the study. Chemical indicators for monitoring vaporized hydrogen peroxide sterilization processes are understood by the sterilization assurance industry to be susceptible to color change when stored outside their native packaging under ambient lighting. Users of vaporized hydrogen peroxide chemical indicators in healthcare facilities are mindful that most of these CIs require storage in their native packaging away from ambient light and chemicals. Despite not being recommended by manufacturers and the practice being inconsistent with labeling storage requirements, it's a known practice that users may store these CIs in open containers or bins on workstations for easy access during the pack and prep operations in the sterile processing department. The objective of our study was to evaluate and compare the performance of the 3M ATES vaporized hydrogen peroxide trimetric CI 1348-1348E to other available vaporized hydrogen peroxide CIs with respect to the color stability of the CIs when exposed to ambient lighting in a workspace. The 3M HS Trimetric CI has been categorized by the US FDA as a multivariable chemical indicator for chemical sterilization and is labeled as an ISO type 4 chemical indicator per ISO 11140-1 2014. The 3M HS Trimetric CI also has a kite mark certification from BSI as an ISO type 4 CI. This study was designed and developed and executed by Dr. Marco Bomarito. Dr. Bomarito is a 3M scientist and the lead developer for the 3M A test vaporized hydrogen peroxide trimetric chemical indicator 1348 1348E. The method, as outlined in the slide, contains vaporized hydrogen peroxide CIs from a total of seven different manufacturers. 30 CIs from each manufacturer were used in the study. The CIs were placed faced up, so the reactive chemistry was exposed to the ambient lighting in the workspace. 
The workspace lights were left on continuously for eight weeks. At time intervals specified in the study, zero days, one week, two weeks, four weeks, six weeks, and eight weeks, the CI color change was measured using a spectrophotometer. By using a spectrophotometer, Dr. Bomarito obtained a numerical color value on the CI color change. A numerical color value provides an objective result for the evaluation of each CI in the study. The color results for each chemical indicator using the spectrophotometer was compared to the color change required for an accept or pass result. This numerical data is summarized in the 3M study. Although we have the numerical values for the CI color change that occurred during the study, I think examining the images of the CIs tested provides a practical demonstration of the results and a clear observation of the color stability and ultimately the quality of the CIs tested. This slide is the first example of the color stability of the chemical indicators tested. First, let's start by looking at the top row. The top row is time zero for the chemical indicators. These are the images of the CIs when the samples were removed from the packaging. The chart includes images from week two, week four, six, and eight. You can see the images, the ASP Sterad product, the Steris Verify product, and SPS Medical product have obvious color change in color by week two. These products should be discarded and not used if this level of color change was observed in your SPD before use. Steris Celerity begins to change color by week six with an obvious color change towards accept by week eight. As you can see in the images from time zero to week eight, the 3M A-Test Trimetric CI was unchanged in color and very stable in color in this study. Demonstrating a high quality of the 3M A-Test Trimetric CI and its superior color stability before use. Now it's very important to explain, as indicated in the slide, the CIs tested in this study were stored outside their native packaging and outside their instructions for use, including the 3M A-Test Trimetric CI. I want to emphasize, always use and store vaporized hydrogen peroxide CIs per their instructions for use. This next chart has the ad addition of a GKE chemical indicator in the fourth row of samples. GKE is a German company and the CI is used in Europe and not FDA cleared for use in US healthcare facilities. The color change can be difficult to interpret at is, as it is a blue to green color change per the instructions for use. In this third chart, in the fourth column of samples, is the addition of a ChemDye chemical indicator. It is a chemical indicator sold by an Argentinian company, Terragene, and is FDA cleared for use in US healthcare facilities. As you can see, there's an obvious color change in this indicator by week two, and probably should be discarded by your facility if this level of color change was observed before use. This study is the basis for 3M's claim that the 3M A-Test Vaporized Hydrogen Peroxide Trimetric Chemical Indicator 1348-1348E is the most color stable of all chemical indicators tested, including ASP, Steris, SPS, and won't change color before sterilization under ambient light for up to eight weeks. I also want to remind everyone the findings should not be interpreted to support or promote any practice inconsistent with manufacturer's labored storage requirements. Always follow manufacturer's storage requirements for vaporized hydrogen peroxide CIs as per their instructions for use. 
with that, I'll hand it back over to Sean. All right. Thank you, Larry. And thanks to everyone for joining us today in this session. We welcome you to review the full compendium of scientific literature on the Trimetric CI, including the white paper on Trimetric CI's color stability after exposure, and the published peer-reviewed articles demonstrating Trimetric CI's ability to detect process failures in a clinical setting, as well as an evaluation of hydrogen peroxide CIs in a laboratory setting. For more information on any of this, please ask your local 3M representative for details or visit www.3m.com forward slash trimetric. Thanks again, everyone, and have a wonderful day.